Some US trials, Worlds, Olympics. That's when I perform at my best. Um, the other meets is preparation. And for some reason, I don't really take it as serious. Other meets, but when it comes to these big meets, I'm in the zone. What were the injuries? Well, calf, meniscus, tear, and hamstring. All this year? Yeah. So um, I'm really glad to be healthy at the right time and to make this team for Doha. When did you start training again? I've just been um, off and on yeah. the training. I'm really excited to be back. Did you tear all those things in one incident? Or no, 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 no. At different times because I was supposed to run in pre-fontaine. I had to pull out at the last minute because I had put my hamstring. Mm -hmm. um, so but I'm excited to be here in USA's. I'm pretty much like the old man in the group. Yeah. You know, I was really excited to keep running. It's been like 13 years now I've been running, or well, 14 years. So I was glad to be at the top at, at this point of my career. Do you, you see him ride? Do you remember when you were the young guy everybody was talking about? Or what do you, what do you think when you see him run so fast? 13 years ago. It's amazing. You know, um, I remember when I was at, at that point, uh, being that age. You know, eventually you have to pass up a baton to the young guys. I'm really, really excited that he, he will take the baton and could, could, uh, could continue running for USA and bringing medals. What do you think of the event now with, you know, Warholm and Benjamin and Samba running these times, you know, that we haven't seen Honestly, for a long time? Um, it's really good for the sport, you know, because um, we haven't seen those times in a long time since I remember Sean and Angela Taylor. So um, it's really good that um, the times are is fast now and hopefully I can keep up. <laughs> But as young, good young boys, I mean, I'll continue to train hard yeah. and to be on the podium. Do you think you can get there? I mean, because it's probably... Of course. Yeah. Of course. I'm a fighter. I've always been right there on the podium. So there's no difference for the, this season or next season. I'm going to be on the podium. Do you, is your plan to go through 2020 and not be it? Or have you thought about... I'm not, well, I'm not going to tell you my plans, but next year, of course, the Olympics. <laughs> tell me about the hair. You like it? Yeah. <laughs> I'm asking about it. <laughs> <laughs> like a little flash, you know, spike. It is for fun. Just got to change up my look to keep keep young and be being um, amongst Grant Holloway and all those guys on your University of Florida. Keep keep keeps me young. You said you love the championships and the big races, and you obviously have a great record in them. Why? Why are you able to race to the occasion so much, so well? Honestly, I love medals. I'm very greedy. <laughs> Seriously. Um, that's when I perform, perform at my best when there's a team on the line or medal on the line. I always find a way to make the team, and I always, you know, make those doubters eat their words because you say, oh, he's old, he won't make the team. Watch me, you'll see. Thanks, bro. All right. All right, thank you.